First Europe vlog clip. We'll see you in two years. <laughs> Everything's ready to publish. I'm just waiting on her. All right, we got up at 4 a.m. It's uh, 5 or 6 a.m. now. We got our tickets. We're waiting. She's pooping. Got through TSA pre-check and the security lady is like, okay, I'm gonna need your ID and um, TSA pre-check me. Because Brian. Welcome to Atlanta. All right, connecting flight. I got the Arby's from the thing. Please, you can be volunteer. Thank you. They overbooked. They need two people to sit out for a thousand. Twelve hundred dollars. So please, people, keep going. Not the last one. Twelve hundred. We only need one person. Please. They raise it to sixteen hundred now. Uh, I have to sit alone for nine hours. Squished in between strangers while this one got to... Uh, why do we have a fifth wheel? Fifth wheel? Third wheel, fifth wheel, odd even wheel. It's so cute. There were a bunch of school kids together on a trip. It makes... How come I didn't get that in, when I was in school? They had a... They look like they were having fun. We don't even know. <laughs> Both at the same time. Alright, we're here. We're checking in at the Four Seasons. And oh no, it is right next to the Hermes. Why is it next to Hermes Paris? This ain't Paris. Why does it say that? Yep, we're outside the Four Seasons. The dad is taking pictures of every single building. He's wandering off. He's got no cell reception. He's just taking photos of absolutely everything. He likes the statue up there. He thinks that's majestic. But he is just wandering off, taking photos of everything. So awesome. <laughs> She's so happy that the Hermes is attached to the freaking hotel. I'm not that no. happy. I'm just like... No, you're crazy. We're not going to visit there every single morning, you crazy ass. Stop looking at it. Don't you look at... Don't look that way at all. Look at your dad. He just loves the architecture of everything in the city. I don't like this street because she likes the street because it has a lot of things that she likes, like a Dior and some other things. And then they got some nice ass statues up there. Such art, art, architect, artisan, design, decorations. I don't know. Calle de Sevilla, a little bit. Uncle Pepe, Tio Pepe. I don't know where we are, but it seems like there's a lot of people in this plaza. There's a bear eating a broccoli or tree. And there's a fancy apple store right over there. But yeah. Look at him, admiring history and buildings and architecture. That looks like a George Washington there. At least be driving through the plaza. There's a lot of things. And nothing's open. Everything opens fucking late as shit. Like 11 to noon. The hotel they're staying at looks pretty unique and chic and hip. The entrance is just a stairway. Wow, looks very classy. They got this cute little dining drinking area. There are cocktails and bar. It's like, I don't know, there's just one green ass drink. It's just green drinks. Look at her waiting for me. This lobby, this room is literally just a staircase. That's it. <laughs> this place is called Dick Waffle. It's a waffle of dick. 17 inches of the sweet. Damn, that's that's ginormous. God damn, it's like 11 past 11 a.m. and places are still freaking closed. I like this place. There's no early morning owls in this city. All right. We're in the middle of some sort of giant plaza. It's got hella rooms. Imagine if this was like a hotel or a landlord owned it all or something. There's a giant statue of a horse, of a guy on a horse. There's a street entertainer of Chucky right over there. And look at these two. Take a, can you take a picture of me and Brian? And like the Mario, the Chucky, the Mickey. There's a lot of the uh, peoples. So yeah, they have a little Caesars here, or there's a 
five guys. What in the fat American is doing in Europe? That whole building's orange for some reason. I don't know why that whole thing's orange. Tapas de China. Okay. Is that just dim sum? We got hams, lambs, hams, potatoes, tomatoes. It's uh, Mercado de San Miguel. There's a lot of people in here, it's crowded. There's a lot of tapas and like charcuterie stuff. He's not driving. He's not driving. Sangrias. This early in the morning. Mercado de San Miguel. That was one of the only things I had on my to-go list. I chugged two sangrias. This is sure it is. And some olives. I'm fucking drunk. I chug those drinks. I chug them on an empty stomach. He's taking a picture of everything. This is just a random thing with the name of the city that he likes. Oh my god. We have a tancha. It's boba. They also had a T4 here. They got a lot of random shit that we recognize. First day. Someone already tried to pickpocket the dad. They almost got pickpocketed. They just gotta turn around and slap the bitch. Seasons. It's a puzzle. Oh, wait. Wow, what a nice big room. <laughs> We're supposed to be adventuring. Yeah, look at them. Look at them. So they're still napping, and I am going to uh, have a little adventure. I got my adventure hat on, this is my outfit. They're still napping, so I'm gonna just explore. I have no, no internet, no nothing. Wow, look at the lobby from up here. It's elegant. Wow, how classy. Right outside of the hotel, there's people playing. Classy. I'm probably gonna get pickpocketed because this is a perfect situation where I'm just out here recording looking like a tourist with my tourist ass hat on. Found a cute little area. Apparently there's a Chinese food, there was dim sum, there was ramen, there was sushi, and there's like a weird little alleyway area that I'm at. Calle de Manuel Fernandez y Gonzalez. Alright, I found the Congreso de los Diputados. I don't even know what that is. Congress of something. We got a nice church and a water fountain down there. We got steep borders with abs over here in this park. But uh, okay. I'm in a random supermarket right now. I have no idea what I'm looking at. I'm thirsty. And then look, they got their Lay's flavors. I don't know what these are off the top of my head. Salt and vinegar is obvious. They got jamon, the jamon Ibier ibierca, whatever things. Chili Doritos. They got 
a pretty decent looking flavor. Tex Mix. Tex Mix is apparently a flavor here. Yeah, they really like the ham flavor because, you know, Spain and that ham. Barbacoa. Oh, I'm so thirsty. I'm going to get all the waters. Alright, I walked all this way for Supermarket Supermercado Udako. It's so interesting seeing uh, Asian people speak uh, Spanish. I think they're Cantonese, but I don't know, the, the woman was speaking pretty low. But then the guy is like straight up talking to me in Spanish, wondering if I need a bag. But god damn, I bought hella drinks. Alright, time to go back, see if they're awake. Alright, I'm back. Let's see if they finally are awake or if they're still napping. Fucking water is seven dollars. Water and soda is so expensive. I went out to the market and I got my own. I got that. 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 But they have no mini fridge in here. Abrupt alarm clock disrupted all their beauty sleep. <laughs> they just woken up from their nap and it's raining, it's great. Oh wow, I hear thunder. I hear thunder in this direction. It's not even raining anymore, no one really cares. It's like um, one drizzle. These are the only people with umbrellas, and look at the nasty ass feet. Flip flops getting all dirty and nasty and looking nasty. And yeah, look, oh, they took out their umbrella. Well, there's an entrance right here. Right now they're in Louis Vuitton. And um, yeah, we're right next to the Galleria Cane Uh I assume it's luxury store stuff up in here. But uh, yeah, this is right next to our hotel. Lots of old ancient architecture. Nice aesthetic old looking ass buildings. Oh, I wonder. Hmm. This is another perspective of our hotel. There's the Four Seasons, there's the Hermes, there's a lot of luxury shopping in there. And then uh, right across is this fancy building. Everyone seems to be recording all the architecture and pretty things here. But there's also tons of police just blocking off the intersection here for some reason. There's like 20 police peoples. Everyone's standing here watching, seeing if someone's important gonna come out of these cars. They got assault rifles and walkie-talkies or something. But everyone's watching something. They wanna see who comes out. Well, all the police people left, but I heard someone over say Crown Princess of Jordan. But that's all I heard. I don't know if it's true or not. Holy shit, it's been like an hour. They're still there. I'm pretty sure they bought something. Probably a wallet or something. God damn it. It's been like an hour. It's a vlog actually. Welcome here. It's a video. It's a video. All right, so they have a uh, Wagyu that's still cheaper than uh, Japan. Mm. <laughs> Gosh, area in it. 
Beef tartare, interesting. Raw meat, mushroom, and eel. That's my truffle tortellini. That's 30 something dollars. Yeah, it's truffle. 10 pieces. 10, 10 pieces, 30 bucks. <laughs> He wanted this dry aged steak because it's Father's Day in America, but it's not Father's Day in Spain because Father's Day in Spain is in March because it's feast, whatever, Saint holiday. Alright, that restaurant was like 400 euros of food. All the nice architectures of fraud. Look at the nice details and designs. And then the side, just flat, just concrete, bricks on the back. All of it is fake. It only looks good from the front, from the back and the side. It's a lie. We just finished eating, they're having loud conversations. Ron, is that a fuzzy or a bed bug? Fuzzy. These are not free. Because if they were free, they would advertise it. See, that's the same brand where we had that. Um, yeah, I know. Your favorite. Favorite. This one says comp complimentary. Oh, they're two different flavors: manchango cheese and banana mix. Mm. Hey, they do have um hamon. They got a gay building. Uncle Pepe. There's tons of people just sitting out here at night. Why are they just out here sitting? Who knows? There's a lot of people chilling. They bought phone case necklace things. Phone case necklace. Oh, so touristy. So foreign. So Japanese. They're getting gelato at Nicolo. Her dad is just wandering down the street down there. Look at her taking photos of her ice cream. Just in the middle of the road with her ice cream. Okay, say love. These hungry little rabbits literally look like just eating ice cream. <laughs> Hotel Marriott. Day. 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 Wow. Wow. Shower. No. Same. Closet. Couch. Bed. Background. We just dropped off the parents at the hotel. They're talking smack because they don't know how to survive without the kids. The parents are struggling. And there's still tons of people out here at night. It's like past 11 p.m. And they're just sitting and chilling. This is the spa. They're calling them and they're still annoying with the data plan. We're gonna check out the gym and the pool, but the pool is closed. Wow, and each equipment comes with a water. You could come here and grab a water. Grab a bunch of waters. They have it on every single piece of equipment. I wonder if I could go into the pool though. I'm wondering is... Ooh, okay. They have more ice cold waters down here and towels and what is that oh coffee coffee and waters and some mineral mineral infusion she's bleeding from her little toes i was so scared i was like why are you mumbling 
Your sister thought you were fainting. <laughs> and I'm just like, what? No. No way someone can faint. I knew she always be dramatic. I was like, day one. I'm already injured on day one. I already I have a bandaid. Do you really need one? Yeah, I'm bleeding. I'm gonna borrow this one. It is 1 a.m. There's still tons of nightlife. It still feels hella safe. And I'm going out to buy some contact solution because my dumb ass didn't pack it because I didn't hear my baby. But it's no problem. I gotta go to a pharmacy. God damn, they ain't got no drug stores here. It's all in the pharmacies. Well. So it's a 24 hour pharmacy. You gotta go to pharmacies to buy your contact solutions. And you gotta ring the button because it's sketchy and closed off. But you do, you answer it. She comes to the door and then I was like, oh, quiero comprar liquido para lentes de contactos. And she said, she's like, pequeño? And I was like, no, 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 largo. But then yeah. And then all the guys here at night, it's like 1 a.m. They approach me, they're like, you want a drink? Uh, and then there's hella people that are just trying to get me to drink. It's so fun and tempting. And then, but there's a lot of like nightlife. I see like a bunch of like students, young people, they all go into bars and clubs. Let me see if I can go back the same way I came and record it. But yeah, I got it. That was easy. It's fun. Ah, having walkable life that's safe and nice and the weather's great. Ah. But yeah, walking down the alleyways, there's bars. I think a guy just went up to me. Something about sex. Prostitutes maybe. Who knows? Watching, walking down a sketchy alley now where there's no one. But yeah, now I was uh, approached by females. It's kind of the same thing in the Las Vegas Strip where they have like pictures of naked women and they're like interested in chicas. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> oh, what a lost, lonely, absolutely no one here. Just me in an empty alleyway, random people. Five minutes ago, like in a turn around the corner, offer me drinks and chicas. But no, I'm a child of Jesus. This is fun walking around at like 2 a.m. now. This was only seven dollars or seven euros, the contact solution. All right, and I am washing the clothes. Can you wash my socks and underwear? Wash your socks and underwear, where are they? They should be in a dirty bag. I I should have told me I was marinating it.